Uh, here we are once again with the evil scientist Bob and his buddy Wilson, who's having breakfast right now. And today, Bob is playing with his toys. I mean, uh, adult collectibles. He totally doesn't have a bunch of action figures around his room, and he isn't totally having a big medieval war. Uh, this is awesome. Uh, oh, wait, was that a horn? Man, who could that possibly be this early in the morning? Uh, oh, boy. You know, Bob has a little bit of explaining to do. So it appears that the Mafia is here to recover their debt. Now, many of you might not know, Bob owes the Mafia a lot of money. You know, these big experiments he does cost a ton. And he took out maybe a couple loans for several million dollars uh, while promising to pay it back with interest. And uh, it seems that the Mafia is here uh, to collect the debt. Oh boy, that's, uh, it's not good. Okay, it's fine. Bob's just gonna go ahead and escape and- Wait, what's that under the car? Oh! Uh-oh, the car was rigged. Oh boy, this isn't good. Well, this might be the end of Bob and- Oh! Okay. Well, that was just rude. Oh no, and it also looks like they rigged the house to explode. Wait a minute, is that a cigar? Uh-oh. Uh, oh, that's bad. And, oh, jeez! Oh, yep, there goes the house. Yep, the Mafia blew up Bob's house. Oh no, and all of Bob's action figures. Oh, those things are priceless. This is ridiculous. Oh yeah, and I forgot about Wilson. He's totally priceless too. Uh, he's not replaceable. Oh boy. Well, this isn't good. Where in the heck are they taking Bob? Oh boy. Well, folks, this might be it. This might be the end of Bob. He's been abducted by the Mafia. No telling where they're gonna actually take him. Hey, but at least they left Wilson on the table. Well, it would seem like Bob has been abducted and he's in some sort of weird warehouse. So you guys thought that Bob was dead. Well, uh, these people have life syringes too. So he's been through a little bit of an interrogation looking for the money. And you know what? Bob's a strong soul. He doesn't talk. So I'm pretty sure the mafia might find different methods of making Bob talk. Let's hope they don't go to those extremes. <laughs> All right, well, it would seem that the mafia members have left Bob alone for a little bit. Uh, they're probably gonna go get another device. Uh, okay, how do we get, how do we get this out? Uh, oh, oh. There we go. All right, so the knife's out, but man, uh, we've suffered a little bit of blood loss. If we can only reach one of those syringes. Uh, oh, you know what? It would seem that the uh, the chair's attached to the ground. Well, we could use the knife to maybe cut the ropes here. I don't know if that's even a thing. Uh, we're gonna try it anyways. We're gonna get out of this. All right, well, carefully try to cut the rope. I don't think Bob's uh, arm can reach that far. Wait a minute, I think something's coming. Uh-oh. Just act cool. Act like it's still in your uh, in your leg. Holy man, one of the Mafia members is back. This is fine. Uh, yeah, I'm still uh, still in pain. This is cool. How about you come in just a little bit closer, huh, Mr. Mafia Man? You know what Bob's gonna do? Bob's just gonna go, uh, there we go. All right, it's time for Bob to get the heck out of here. Just keep shaking yourself until eventually the rope snap. This is definitely a thing, right? I'm sure it is. Come on, come on, come on, come on. No, oh, there we go. Yes, all right. Seems that the chair is not attached. Oh no, uh, the guy's getting back up. You know, what? go for him, Bob. Uh, just beat him up. Push the knife further in. Oh, that actually worked. Huh. Okay, now to get these uh, back ropes off. All right, if we could just get to the life syringes. Uh, poke yourself. Oh, did that work? Oh, uh, oh geez. Uh, oh. Hey, look, it actually worked. Hey, all right, get that pulled out of you. So Bob's back to full health. Just gotta get the last rope off. It's gonna take a little bit of work. You know, he could flip himself over. How about, how about that? Oh, okay. Well, Bob just seems to be stuck in a weird position right now. All right, if he could get his leg up on top of the box. There we go, whew. All right, well, the ropes are off. Time to get the tie off his head. He's gotta find a way out of this stupid warehouse though. All right, Bob sees two more Mafia members down here. Uh, you know, these conveniently placed crates look a little bit unstable. There's a chance Bob can knock these over. 
All right, Bob, you got to push. You got to push here. We'll give you a little bit of assistance. And oh, there we go. Uh-oh. Uh, does the other one notice that his buddy just got knocked out? Bob, push it on him. And uh, there we go. Good job, Bob. All right, now go find the front door. All right, how in the heck do we get out of here? And oh, this door looks solid. What the heck? All right, looks like the uh, the way to open it's on the outside. There's got to be another switch in the warehouse somewhere. And oh, is something happening outside? Oh no, it looks like the uh, the crime boss is back with more henchmen. Okay, uh, Bob, you need to turn around. Make a run for it. Uh, there's got to be something in this stupid warehouse that we can... Uh-oh, that guy's back up too. Oh man, that guy probably called for backup. All right, Bob, you know what to do. Uh, just, just grab the weapon. You know how to use these, right? Bob, that's totally not how you use that. Oh, geez. Ah, uh, here we go. You know what? Bob's gonna engage in hand-to-hand -hand combat with the henchmen, and uh-oh. I think Bob's getting the snot beat out of him here. Bob, you better hurry up and finish him off before the, uh, the mob boss comes in. Dude, look at Bob go! Oh, he's getting hit over the head. Oh, push him down! Do something to him! Oh, boy. Dude, this is an intense fight. Who's gonna win? Can Bob actually, uh, somehow manage to do this? That henchman's kinda tall. Uh-oh. Oh, they're dangerously close to the edge here. They might fall off. I have no clue what's happening. This is like the worst fight I think I've ever seen. Uh oh, but the henchman's got the high ground and... Uh oh, no! Man, Bob needs some sort of backup. He can't do this. Wait, what the heck is that up there? Uh, wait, is that Wilson? Wait, how is Wilson actually still alive? And, oh, okay, Wilson, be careful with the gun. Wilson, what are you doing? Wilson, uh, Wilson's trying to fly Bob out right now. Uh-oh. Okay, Wilson's kind of dumb. But hey, look, they defeated the, uh, the henchman. Huh. The Mafia must use some sort of life syringe on Wilson. So he's actually back and alive for once. That's kind of weird. So Bob and Wilson try desperately to find a way out of the warehouse. But Bob realizes, you know what? He tried to pay the Mafia off several times. He actually gave them some of his fantastic creations, including the black hole to Minecraft. You remember that episode? Yeah, that was a thing. Well, Bob's got an idea. If he activates this, he could totally take out the Mafia members uh, that are outside. I just don't know what's going to happen to Bob and Wilson. They might both perish in this. Uh, we're going to have to see here. All right, we have no options. Three, two, one, activating. Oh, 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 there goes everybody. Wait, where are the Mafia members? Uh, oh, oh, wait a minute. Where did Bob and them go? Hey, some of the Mafia members actually made it in, except for the people outside. I think they're dead. Hey. Hey, look, it's Steve. Hi, Steve. You remember Bob? Uh, Bob's back in Minecraft world. He needs a little bit of assistance, though. So we have totally a ton of angry uh, mafia members that are coming to this realm. Uh, Steve probably knows a little solution. Uh, isn't that right, Steve? Also, by the way, Wilson died again. It's fine. Uh, Wilson was a hero here. He helped save Bob. Wait a minute. What's that? Oh, no. Well, it looks like the mob arrived. This might be the end of Bob, unless Steve can pull something out of his pocket. Wait, is this what's in Steve's pocket? You gotta be kidding me. I think Steve's still salty over the last time we showed up in Minecraft World. I'm pretty sure we destroyed a couple things. Come on, Steve. Just, uh, we'll, we'll pay you millions of dollars if you just help us just this once. You know, Steve very easily could have... Oh. Yeah, Steve was still pretty angry. Well, I still believe it's in the best interest of Steve to help us here to get these Mafia members out of the Minecraft realm. Oh, would you look at that? Steve totally had this under control. Oh, this is going to be a big boom. And oh, hey, Steve did it. He came through. Uh, he, he blew up the uh, blew up the mafia members. Man, Steve is the best, isn't he? Uh, oh, he probably wants us to go back to our world. You know what? It's fine. Come on, Wilson. And uh, Bob, let's get the heck out of Minecraft realm here. Uh, we'll leave Steve here to clean up the mess. Oh boy. Well, as you can see, Bob no longer has a house, but you know what? He's got his life. He's happy. He's thankful for Steve uh, for helping him out there. Uh, Wilson's already back in the house. Uh, Wilson, that's not how you house. Uh, oh, you know what? It's fine. We'll let Wilson do Wilson things. Well, now Bob has to rebuild his whole empire once again. All right. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode of People Playground. We actually use the Mafia mod. It's one of the top workshop mods right now. This thing is cool. You get tons of different characters. Uh, you get different props. Like this is a, a prop cigar or a cigarette. Uh, and yeah, it actually does light stuff on fire. It might take a second here. Hold on, let's put it down on his head real quick. There we go. Huh? There we go. I knew he was flammable. 
But yeah, it adds a ton of people. You've got cars. You even have some weapons. There's like the Tommy gun that we use, like some shotguns. And then you do have police. This is actually one of the coolest mods I've seen in a while. And I strongly suggest you guys check it out. I mean, also, they have kind of like a Bob looking mob boss. Like, check that out. Bob looks classy. Holy man. Looks like he's ready to take over the world here. So yeah, you have some cool weapons. You got some cool melee weapons. A lot of stuff in this mod. And like I said, there's some vehicles here too for you guys to check out. Well, while uh, Bob is doing mobster... Oh, you know what? We need to put Bob out real quick. I guess the best way to do that is with a Tommy gun. Bye, Bob. There we go. He's perfectly fine. But anyways, go check out the mod. Thank you guys for watching. We'll see you guys next time.